really stupid ideas, and um, <laughs> I still do. But um, early, early on, like they're they're really stupid. Tom used to say that too. What's that? Video sometimes that's interview. You know, oh, you know, John Nacho, you, you want to do this? You want? Ed's don't do that, and they come to be like, hey, you think this is stupid? And they go, well. <laughs> kind of like yes, he's like, but you know, you're being creative. You're thinking outside the box. You're trying something new. Like you know, I don't want to. Um, I don't put the flame out on that. But yeah, I, yes, that kind of sucks. But you know, keep it up. For for a while, I was like a, I was gonna revolutionize the business with this move called the intestinizer. And basically, it was like slam somebody and then do a head spin on their stomach. And I I thought it was gonna be like my spin running or, or people's elbow or something. <laughs> And um, I did it a couple times. I hit the Thunder Liger with it a couple years back at uh, WrestleCon. Um, I hit it on Capitelli once, like really solid. I got two rotations. But then sometimes I just like fell over and hurt my neck. So, you know, so put that on the shelf? Well, that was like, that was one of the things where like, I, tr I started doing that on live events. And then every time I came back, Joey would be like, dude, you can't, you can't do that <laughs> in front of people. I hit it one time on, on a... With, on, on my own, I hit it on Jeff one time, and uh, when I came back, Arn like uh, pulled me aside. He's like, "I'm not sure. Come here. Uh, first of all, I don't know how you did that, but really, I don't know why." <laughs> <laughs> he didn't know which one he wanted to ask you for. <laughs> yeah, he's like, he, he's like, I was impressed, but that, what, what, why would you? Why? Do that? <laughs> So first, I was uh, because I was the Chris Logan, so I had like Wolverine tights all the time. I had this Wolverine haircut going, but I was still very vanilla. Just I was like, oh, I just kind of look like Wolverine. And we're Dusty pulled me aside. He goes, uh, he tells me, he goes, hey man, look, you you're great out there. You're great in the ring. He's like, but we need so we need a captain for you, baby. We need something. He's like, what's that? He's like, Matt, what's that guy's name? What's that superhero name? He goes. Uh, is that the Honey Badger? What's his name? <laughs> 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 the Honey Badger. Goes, the honey badger baby. You, you mean the Wolverine? Yeah, yeah, that the Wolverine, the Wolverine, you, you need to be the Wolverine, but you can't be the Wolverine, you just trademark, you're going to be something else, but you need to be the Wolverine, and I'm like, oh, okay, so. Do you ever start calling you the honey badger? <laughs> 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 Dude, so, New t-shirts coming soon, coming soon. Yeah. <laughs> you know, the other, the world's number one most aggressive animal. This is the honey badger. <laughs> but because they go for the groin. I'll watch the Discovery Channel. Here's, here's my favorite match that I pitched that I never got to, like, there's two that I never got to do in WWE that I, I still want to do maybe in, uh, in Lucha. One of them was I wanted to do a tanning bed match against Sheamus. <laughs> Loser gets locked in a tanning bed for like 20 minutes, and then he would come out looking like Brother Love, like all red and stuff. <laughs> didn't, they just, didn't they just do a commercial with him doing that? Like coming out of a tanning spot? Stole my idea. Yeah, there it is. I'll, I'll just pitch that in 2010. Yep. And he must have found it in the backlog. Hey, look, this one that Hennigan wrote up. Let's steal this. Yeah. Uh, the other one, which I, th I think would be fun to do in Lucha sometime, is a porta potty match. Like, you tease it, like, the whole show, and, like, you have everyone, like, uh, use this porta potty and then to win the porta potty match, you have to get locked in, and it tipped over. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Genius. <laughs> like, I love oh, match almost, because everyone's like, participating, but not like, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Think about it. Phoenix walks out, Pentagon walks out, King Cuerno, Cage's got his nutrition solutions, like, right. he walks out with his little thing. That's why I, then I go to the catering dessert section and walk back in again. I'd probably, yeah. every third person, I'd go back in there. And <laughs> <laughs>